We're gonna take Hulk Lamborghini shopping. So Hulk is the Lamborghini of the dog world, but he is the all-time pinnacle Lamborghini of the dog world. It's mind-blowing to think that I went from being homeless before in my life to, you know, about to purchase a Lamborghini. Roll it. Should be playing like gospel music. Should be playing right now. <laughs> My Corvette Victoria has been at the tuning shop. Can't wait to see her again. So today I'm gonna go pick up my newly transformed Corvette and uh, we're gonna take Hulk Lamborghini shopping. I'm gonna take my buddy Tommy with me, good friend of mine and an absolute car enthusiast as well. Tommy is gonna pull out the old Lamborghini Huracan Performante and we're gonna hop in that thing. Ready to go see your baby? Yeah, oh man, I haven't seen that thing forever. I wonder if it's dirty, what the? Marlon's been obsessed with cars since I've known him. Dogs, my kids, my family is, you know, definitely what I love the most in life, but I definitely have a, a very, very deep attachment to cars. People ask me all the time if I have a bucket list. Yeah, I do, but it's just a list of cars. There it is! You notice something. Oh, there's the beast. So this is Victoria. It's a, a 2015 Chevrolet Z06 Corvette. It's pretty much the flagship of, of Corvette aside from the ZR1. <laughs> yeah, a whole new beast. That's just what I want to hear right there. It's so great to see my car again. You hear it? Oh man, I'm ecstatic. It's, just, it's snappy, it barks now. Like it has a little bit more bark to it. That's that's like what I want. Like you can, you can just feel it. You know what I mean? I just can't wait to get it on on the road and feel what it's like on the street. But Hulk, Hulk is just yeah. He he wasn't impressed. I think he feels like we need to make it to a thousand horsepower. He wasn't he wasn't quite impressed yet. So. This was like a dream car. So when I achieved it, it was like, you know, oh yeah, dude, oh. You know, I just wanted to start there. Kind of got my feet wet, and then it was just like, the addiction just started to take over. It's time for the Lambo, you know? So next up, we're gonna head over to Lamborghini Boston, which, you know, is just a real magical kind of moment in my life to realize that this is like real. It's mind blowing to think that you know, I've went from being homeless before in my life to you know, here I am, you know, about to purchase a Lamborghini. So we're at the Lamborghini dealership and everyone's really excited to meet Hulk. Hi guys. Hi Hulk. How you doing? How's it going? Hi, Hi buddy. Hi. Everyone was talking about the Hulk before I knew what the Hulk was. So I was expecting the Hulk. And when I saw the dog, I knew exactly what it was. He's everything that the word is, and he's a friendly giant. So I can understand why he's so popular. Anywhere you go with Hulk, I mean, he brings like, you know, hysteria, man. You know what I mean? Like people love this dog. So I think they were more excited about meeting Hulk than, you know, I was to be there. People are getting that social media buzz on, you know what I mean? All right. Oh man, I need to make more money. <laughs> I'd literally buy all these and live in a cardboard box. Like, I'd be fine with that. Uh, yeah, she wants a I don't know if she'd be okay with She's that. She's on the whole house thing right now. My passion and something I always wanted was horses, and I've got that now. But I definitely would, I'd have fun with a Lamborghini. I like that one, but I don't know, like, what, what she doesn't We're gonna drive the know. white one, but we'll see, you know? You gotta drive it first to really yeah. get that feel. Yeah. And then yeah. we can um, decide which colors you love. We could get a car exactly the color of Hulk's um, leash in passion. Well, do you want to drive it? Oh. Ah. Oh, man. Hulk's looking like, where's his seat? He wants to come with. Bro, listen, you got to get a license first. When I buy it, bro, you'll be the first ride in it, I promise. Uh. <laughs> Second ride in it. I think Hulk wanted to come with, but unfortunately in this situation, there's only two seats and you have to travel with somebody from, from the dealership. I think 
Jamie wasn't fully prepared for like, you know, a like mid send. Because it wasn't a full send, it was just like a mid send. But you know, by Lambo, I mean, you gotta send a little bit. Send it! shaken but no the first one i was scared <laughs> i gotta be honest he just went for it and didn't even warn me yeah. Yeah. Well, we're here we're good the we're good. road was <laughs> wide open and it was just right there dude she will literally be like I, like i'm trying to get a reaction out of her and she just literally like <laughs> marlon's really excited and there's a lot of beautiful cars here he's picked out a few that he really likes but it's still not exactly what he wants and when you're spending that much money you want to make sure that it's exactly what you want so we're looking into our options now and uh, we're gonna take it from there. So hopefully by the, the springtime, me and Hulk will be rolling in a Lambo. Rolling. Hulk is the Lamborghini of the dog world, but he is the all-time pinnacled Lamborghini of the dog world. You know, to compare him to a Lamborghini would essentially mean there's a price. So he's much more valuable than Lamborghini. It's priceless. Fair to say, Hulk paid for this, this, and this. He paid for everything. That's his car. Maybe he'll let me drive it though. I'm, I'm, I'm a very thankful, blessed human being at the end of this day. I get to wake up each day and, and uh, spend time with the people I love and, and, and do these amazing things like you know, shop for Lamborghinis and, and hang out with, you know, just, just great people, man. I love, I love, you know, the people that I'm around. You know what I mean? I'm, I'm, I'm blessed, I'm thankful at the end of the day.